India's attack kills five pack soldiers. Destroys terror launch pads. Reports Indian Army's attack in Pakistan occupied Kashmir has reportedly killed nearly five Pakistani soldiers and has destroyed four terror launch pads. Several other Pakistani soldiers have been injured in the attack. Reports said the army launched attack on terrorist camps in Pak in retaliation to the support provided by Pakistan army to push terrorists into Indian territory by violating ceasefire. India launches attack on terror camps in Pakistan occupied Kashmir Indian army on Sunday used artillery guns to attack terrorist camps situated in Pakistan occupied Kashmir. Pak. The attack was carried out in retaliation to the support provided by Pakistan Army to push terrorists into Indian territory by violating ceasefire on Sunday. Two soldiers were martyred and a civilian was killed in the ceasefire violation by Pakistan Army. UK Parliament passes law mandating PM Johnson to seek Brexit delayed UK Parliament on Saturday passed the Letwin Amendment, withholding support for Prime Minister Boris Johnson's Brexit deal and mandating him to request a Brexit delay. The Parliament withdrew support until the government passes all other legislation needed to avoid the no-deal Brexit. Following the vote, Johnson said that he'll not negotiate in any delay for Brexit with the European Union. Longest non-stop passenger flight lands in Sydney after 19 hours in the Earth World's longest non-stop passenger flight landed in Sydney from New York after 19 hours and 16 minutes in the air. A total of 49 people were on board the Qantas QF7879 flight, which covered a 16,200-kilometer distance. Four pilots were on rotation throughout the test flight, which was used to run experiments to assess health and well-being on board. It was a misunderstanding. B after BSF Jowan martyred in firing after Border Security Force Head Constable VJ Ban. Singh was martyred in firing by Border Guard Bangladesh personnel. Bangladesh's Home Minister Asad Izzaman Khan said it happened due to a misunderstanding between the border forces. Khan added he'll talk to his Indian counterpart Amit Shah, if required, to defuse the situation. BSF Constable Rajveer Yadav sustained injuries in the firing.